Hi, I'm Anna. I'm Sophie. Hi, I'm Fred. We're all undertaking a BA course at Chicken Shed. Um, so this is our third year of the course and we're doing a show called Represent. It's one of 599 hate crimes reported to them. Main objective about this whole piece is to try and get young people to vote and try and see the importance of voting. How you can't really say much about what's going on in your your community or or your country if you don't put your two pence in. We had such a fear that with such a specific issue, pe the kids wouldn't take to it at all. We were so scared that they would be oh, boring. Because that was me at school. I still like until I did this show. I'm not a massive fan of politics. I didn't follow it. I didn't understand it. I was so confused, I've never voted. Please, something new, something changed, something different, and that's what we're trying to do with this piece. It's nice, as a young person, to be able to taught, be taught it in a different way. Um, studying it from a book, is some people find that hard, and I think that comes with inclusion in general. Teaching a topic in various forms, whether it's through dance, song, through a, a notebook, and. And that's why we try to make our workshop as practical and different as possible so that everybody can learn something from it. It's good to see that our, our show is impacting a few people. We've managed to be really fearless within our movement. Courses, I, I, I really enjoy it. We've grown more as professionals. In terms of the inclusion, I think that's like a massive part of it. It just becomes second nature within the practicalities of it in the preparation yourselves, being inclusive with each other, and then knowing that when you go to deliver a workshop, it has to be just as inclusive. It's never really finished, our, like our piece. It's very much on always developing, always changing. Always a work in progress. Always a work in progress. You never see like the same show done twice. We've managed to, to make a really eye-opening piece. Representing yourself as a young person in society, has, it, it gets more and more difficult and when those opportunities arise where you partake in a vote and decide how your country is run, I think people shy away from doing that. We always say even if it changes one person's mind, we've done our job. 